Hello students of class 10. So today I am going to give you some home assignments, some verbs. Okay, so you have to solve these questions and you can send it to me. See, uh, these are the questions uh, which I am going to give you. Means uh, these are the pattern of the question which I am going to give you in the half examination. And uh, these are the questions which, which, which were frequently asked in the board exam okay so this is the this is a board pattern question you can say it okay board pattern question so please try to do it and if you find any difficulty you can ask me so here uh, the question one is find the coordinates of a point a where a b is the diameter of a circle whose center is 2 comma minus 3 and b is the point 1 comma 4 that means the diameter diameter of a circle, circle is placed in Cartesian plane. Okay, circle is placed in Cartesian plane. Then the end points of the diameter are A and B, where the coordinate of A is not given. You have to find it, but coordinate of B is given and the center coordinate of center point is given. You have to find the coordinate of A. Okay, so you have to apply what section formula, or you can say the special case of section formula that is midpoint formula. Okay, so try to do it. Next is question number 2. For what value of k, the roots of the equation x square plus 4x plus k are real. So you know that we have to find the value of the discriminant. Uh, if, uh, if they are real, then there was a condition. Okay, discriminant, the value of discriminant lies uh, in lies in a number. Uh, so just check it. Uh, the quadratic equation is having real roots if uh, what happened to the discriminant you have to just check number three is how many two digits number are divisible by three so first of all you have to find all the two digit numbers okay so you have to make a sequence okay which are divisible by three you have to make a sequence and like that you have to apply the uh, the formula which we have studied in arithmetic progression so try to do it Next is question number 4. This is figure is given. Here it is given DE is parallel to BC and AD is 1 cm, BD is 2 cm. So we have to find what is the ratio of area of triangle ABC to the area of triangle ADE. So see the line DE is parallel to the third side. So there was a condition. You have to see the condition. According to that condition, you have to apply the formula. So here is the next question, question number 5, which term of the AP, this 3, 15, 27, 39 will be 120 more than its 21st term. Number 6 is if SN, the sum of first 10 terms of an AP is given by SN is equal to 3N square minus 4N, find the nth term, 7 number, find the ratio in which the segment joining the points 1, minus 3 and 4 comma 5 is divided by the x axis also find the coordinates of this point on the x axis number 8 find the value of c if the system of equation cx plus 3y plus bracket 3 minus c equal to 0 comma 12x plus cy minus c equal to 0 has infinitely many solution so the next question, a fraction becomes 1 by 3 when 2 is subtracted from the numerator and it becomes 1 by 2 when 1 is subtracted from the denominator. Full stop, find the fraction. Number 10, father's age is 3 times the sum of the ages of his two children. After 5 years, his age will be 2 times the sum of their ages. Full stop, find the present age of the father. Okay. So try to do these questions. I have given you total 10 questions. So, if you have any doubt, you can ask me. Uh, after four days, I will give uh, I will give you again another another set of ten question. Okay. So, try to do this question. Okay. So, thank you.